Hi. In a previous video, I um, showed the possibilities of uh, custom uh, calculation applications for actual fans where uh, a lot of things could be automated, a lot of things that uh, a user inputs like customer, if he, if he puts in a customer automatically, uh, things like the discount change and uh, stuff like that. If he puts in a reversible fan, automatically you get reversible impellers. And if you go like to bigger sizes, automatically you lose your high speed option and stuff like that. Now, such applications can be built uh, using uh, Excel as a base that has been done by us, or you could uh, build such applications using some database product like uh, FileMaker or Microsoft Access, or you can even um, we can even develop such programs from scratch as web applications because a lot of uh, a lot of uh, companies or manufacturers are global in nature. They require that program, or a lot of people all over the world would require such a program. So a web app would be a a, a good candidate. So uh, any way you do it, it's basically the work is the same. Basically, such an application has to integrate all the rules and regulations regarding each. Uh, product of that manufacturer, they have, they have to translate those rules into a program, into an application, which automates and works every time uh, a user selects something. Like for instance here, now uh, it w uh, the user requires that when you select the jet fan that you automatically get the silencers. Well, that rule has been set by the manufacturer and has been integrated into this program it doesn't matter whether that program is now uh, an Excel program or based on a database program or, or even a web app. It doesn't matter. What matters is, <clears throat> is that such an application gets done ASAP in order for the salespeople to be able to handle a higher uh, workload faster. And furthermore, I mean, now in this sample application all i have here is the cost and the mass and the article number and maybe the description but obviously other other stuff can be can be added as well for instance like drawings you could have here a link where you click on and you get a drawing of that specific casing or you could have like a number here telling you how much of that specific casing you got on stock at that uh, time so you know okay do we have to order uh, some 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 more casings if if I have a bigger order or or is my stock are my stocks okay then I also have like you can also have production times in here and stuff whatever stuff you want so such such applications are very customizable and they have to be customized to the manufacturer's requirements and more importantly to the manufacturer's uh, rules now uh, most of the calculation applications have started off as Excel applications and they have evolved over time. Mind you, such a calculation application is not a one-off operation. I mean, um, you start off with something and uh, this manufacturer continuously introduces new products and phases out new products and stuff like that. And, and some products get like new components and stuff like that. So all of that stuff has continuously to be uh, implemented or integrated into that application. So such an application is um, not like, you know, like a project, okay, it has a deadline and then that's it. No, it is a, it's like a website. It's, it has to, it is, it is under continuous development. A lot of stuff is done by the, by the, by the, by the salespeople themselves. They input the data, they input new prices and stuff like that. That's no problem. But a lot of stuff has to be done by the developer. And that includes, you know, um, integrating new products, changing the rules uh, and stuff like that. And um, what we do, we don't just develop such programs. We also train people to be able to develop such programs. Obviously, <clears throat> when, we, when we train people to develop such programs, most of the development will take place in Excel because Excel is a very powerful tool, especially for such applications. Uh, in some rare cases, uh, uh, people have built such applications using Access or FileMaker, but still, in my opinion, Excel would be the best application for such uh, for such um, uh, programs. Uh, web apps, hardly nobody, we never taught anybody how to build a web app 
because that would require programming experience and most of the people we are training are, are basically salespeople uh, and not not interested in a programming career and they don't actually even have the time to program an application from scratch so that's in a nutshell um, how such programs are built basically either Excel or some, some sort of database uh, application like Access or FileMaker or from scratch as a web app. The cheapest and most effective way is Excel because when you start off in Excel, uh, you can always uh, take that Excel application and convert it into a web application step by step. You can convert that Excel uh, sheets into code, either C code or VBA code or some other code. You know, the, the, the logic is the same. All you have to do is just convert that into some, some sort of code. So. Most of the projects we did started off as Excel and some stayed as Excel projects where, where, where others uh, evolved into web applications. So it really depends on the, on the, on the requirements of the manufacturer.